Son, can you grab your dad a beer? But dad, it's seven in the morning. Son, can you grab your dad a beer? Okay, dad. Cheers. <sighs> now, son, you're growing up. And I think it's time you heard the story of the mountain men. You told me this yesterday, Dad. Once upon a time, there was a mountain. The biggest mountain in the world. Some wankers said it was just a big fucking hell, but they didn't know jack shit. Can you get your old man a beer? You, you got one in your hands, Dad. You, you just sipped Can it. Can you get your dad a beer, son? Okay, Dad. Cheers. Now, at the bottom of this mountain, there came along two cobbers named Jimbo and Greasy. They pulled up in their big V8 and looked at the mountain. Jimbo said, Let's climb that big old Mount Arino. And Greasy said, Fucking oath. Son, can you grab your dad a beer? What? Dad? Shut the fuck up, son, and grab your dad a beer so he can finish his fucking story. Cheers, mate. So, Jimbo and Greasy went all the way to the top of the mountain in their big V8 and then came back down again. And they liked it so much that they planned to do that 161 times. Uh, you want to know why, son? I know why, Dad. You told me yesterday. It was because they were dead set legends, that's why. Okay, Dad. Now, word spread about Jimbo and Greasy and their noble quest. And people all around town wondered if they could actually do it. This mountain was dangerous. Climbing it once was hard enough. Could they do it 161 times? Uh. Nobody knew. Not even the mountain men themselves. There was only one way for everyone to find out. But before I tell you how it went, could you get your dad a beer, son? Oh, yes. This Saturday, guys. I racing 1000, me and the Southpaw taking it on we're gonna die out of die make sure you're there etc hello if you thought that was funny guys which it fucking is fucking is go over to reese's channel twitter uh, tw say twitch tv he is uh southpaw razor it's a racer even it's a razor southpaw racer on youtube and he is a funny fucker and he deserves your support so go and give him that but hello everybody Buddy, it's a me, Jam Jar. Oh yeah, I'm wearing my backup gloves today, and they're all tight. Nice. We're using the uh, new rim today. <laughs> okay, <laughs> he's like that. Okay, Dad. And they go, Deed, <laughs> Deed, <laughs> but Deed. <laughs> Hello. Right, so last time out we raced at Spa and we somehow came uh sixth. We very very fortunately came sixth. We're gonna keep the difficulty at 106% because even though we struggled in practice and qualifying the race was good. I've got the cheaty clutch set up, but it doesn't quite work the same way in uh in this as it does in uh in other bits. But I am I'm still using a paddle clutch. By the way guys, if you want to see these clutches at the bottom here excuse me in more detail exclamation mark new rim of update the command but a new rim but here we are then k mag actually outscored yesterday we didn't quite beat him to the line it was fifth and sixth for Haas, which is nice because we rarely get a good result and here, here we are then monzarino yeah i read that sam actually after i did the video i was like oh okay well fuck that then Oh, yeah. 
to like a bit of a new rim, boys. You know what I'm saying? Oh man, I'm tired. Um, I've been. Oh. Can I have a quick word? Listen, I don't think the car is hitting its performance targets right now. We really do have to find a lot of improvement. Take a look at the report, and we'll talk about it later. Okay? This is your fault, chat. This is your fault. <laughs> Where are we? Uh, we aren't awful. I mean, where is our graph? Is it this one here? Like the worst color? We're doing all right, ish. Super serious, Chris. Uh, hopefully, we'll be okay. <laughs> for this uh we don't we have some r d points right now but chat has always voted to save actually saying that did chat vote to save we haven't really got much we can do uh in terms of actual performance although i think i might take an executive decision here and go for a durability upgrade because we haven't got any of these pretty much so i think it'd be a good idea to do that um i've got the ice so, usually I'd ask chat for that, but I'm going to take the executive decision and go for that and get that done ASAP. We can save the rest from there. Oh, it's hot here. Well hot in the box. I'm going to have to open up the fucking box a bit, I think. It means you get to get to see the shorts. This is a new patch, I guess. Um, I've not really driven it. So, let's put in all the shit box bits for practice. Uh, now, th this is going to mean we're actually be quite far down in Pracky because Monza, of course, a lot of it is about having decent straight line speed, etc. And we will not have any of that here with the these old bits. So that's going to be interesting. Um, just keep that in mind, I guess, while we're going around. 69 versus 61. Okay. How I set the bite point again. Okay, I'm going to op I'll, I'll open my box quick. Oh, that good song. Open my box to public uh, consumption. Shorts! Welcome to Chatterbait. Short edition. And these gloves are so tight. Love it. Professional. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Right, okay. So let's, let's explain the bite point on this again very quickly. So you have two paddles. You have the master and the slave paddle. I'm a big fan of the slave paddle, personally. Um... And the the master is on the right, and the slave is on the left. The master, underneath the master switch, or the paddle, is this little potentiometer bit here. I don't know if you guys can see that or not. And this basically controls how sensitive this is. So on 100%, that's uh, where, you, where you start, where you, where you set the clutch, you have it so when you do that, and you click it in, that is 100% clutch. And what you want to do is you'll sit there, you'll put it in uh, in first gear, hold in this clutch, and rev the tits off it. And then as you're doing that, you adjust this potentiometer until uh, the car starts to creep forward when you've got 100% um, on, on this paddle here. That's how you find the bite point. Hopefully that's understandable. That's, that's my understanding and how I've been doing it. So... No... Back in the laptop. Demonetized because of shots. More likely to be demonetized because of this, actually. So, guys, if it's your first time here, firstly, willkommen, do mein stream gefahrt. I speak fluent German. This is our F1 career mode, full distance races. Chat decides all major decisions until I say they don't. <laughs> no assists, no flashbacks, and no restarts. So. We do, uh, we do, we do things fairly strictly around here. In before rain. Good morning. Oh Enjoy fuck! The final minutes start to tick away before the beginning of practice here in Monza. The Rough day. Working furiously on the cars, making Good morning. Before they get out on track. One of the most famous corners here at Monza is the Variante del Retifilio, uh, the first corner chicane. It's been the scene of so many first lap incidents over the years, and I think the teams will be no skill. <laughs> Hoping that they make it through that corner cleanly at the start today. This is such a 816. find the right breaking point for. 
You approach it around 220 miles per hour down the main straight, then scrub off 170 miles per hour in just over 100 meters. It's very easy, therefore, to overshoot and end um, up driving through the escape road. Where is Ryan? Oh, oh god, that's a good itch. That's a good itch. I'm actually... as. Where's Ryan? I think Ryan's streaming right now, which is sad. Um, we're going to have to go without Ryan. Oh, Angry Birds from the right now, because by the way, guys, if you weren't here last time around, we were promoted to number one driver. So we fucking sucked Magnuson's balls till we could suck them no more, and now we're number one. The D-Ream. Load car setup. Fuck off, Jeff. I haven't done... I'm just looking at my Angry Birds. I don't need your fucking nagging in my ear. Uh, how do I use this again? <laughs> Every time I get to the fucking, the, uh, the menu here for setups, I'm like, oh. Keyboard Italy. I mean, that's going to be good. That's going to be good, the keyboard Italy. Someone gave me so much shit, like, oh, you're using a time trial setup. Oh, you're so stupid. I'm like, oh, shut up, man. Uh, let's take this. It's a Renault. That's sort of similar to what my car is. But yeah, I don't care when he was last online. Well, if if uh, if Ryan's done by the time he's done, <laughs> words, then we can hopefully get him to come and spread his disease setups. Did I even load it? No. That'd be fine. Let's go and see what we're like on track acclimatization. This is the first time I'm actually driving with this wheel as well, so hopefully all my buttons work. They should work. I've even got diff set now, which I didn't have before. Flying lap. Who who fucking needs? Who fucking needs to do this? Okay. So this is a green circuit, and I assume this car's going to be a handful. Hi boy diff, not a fan of that. Oh shit, DRS! Oh, oh! That didn't go too well. <laughs> Best start. Yeah, I know. It was like fucking 70% to the front. It just didn't stop. Oh my god, first laps are ropey, aren't they? Jesus Christ. Ryan bottled it. He truly is my son. Yeah, don't feel too bad on turning. Okay, apparently he wants me to go over there. Did I still fucking... Did I still do the program despite missing <laughs> the first corner. Oh, I nearly made it. I made it in spirit.
Uh, it's at uh, 1 p.m. GMT, so 2 p.m. BST. God, this car is slippy. Thank you, Superboy, for the two pounds. Saying DRSOP, two OP for you. Yeah, man. Thank you for the two pounds. All my buttons have changed around. I'm using a different wheel. So, oh, jeez. This is the last lap of the program. Final lap of the program. This time, three seconds off for Stappen around the fucking. Glorified oval. Ass! Well, we end on that. So at least we've got the the. Uh, not so. I might actually do it again because I'm not feeling very happy with this at the moment. Ass! Ah, nice, Clark. That's a good enough excuse not to watch. Oh, so it was very floaty. You seem to be struggling a little in the following turns. Turn one. Everywhere. So it's not the one fifty. I mean, fucking Jeff with the put down again. Oh my god. It's not fast at the moment. Oh my god, really? Already? Fucking bug? Fuck off! Jesus Christ. Hashtag blame the buggos. To me, average boy. Okay. points fucking low. I 
I did T1 saw right. Good. Boy. First time. Oh, Ryan's here. Hello, Ryan. How do I use my, uh... Ugh. Sorry guys, just booting up Discord so I can get old real Jeff in here. I hear he had a... I, I saw, like, briefly, he's had a tough race, but so I'll be kind to him. Maybe. So Ryan, I hear you bottled it. <laughs> Mate, I, I'm literally <laughs> human, I'm telling you. <laughs> oh, God. But yeah, I'm ignoring that. <laughs> We've got you to sort out. I want you to do well here. Oh, Monza's wow. easy. Are you sure? <laughs> yes, Monza's P easy, mate. It's literally <laughs> legit easy. This one. Um, are you ready? To... Yeah, um, I've all... wait, I'm just pressing my buttons. Yes, give me a second. Uh, <laughs> I just took some pikey set out from the forum, so I'm not sure that's going to work. Nah, pikey sets, nah. You don't, you don't, what, what forum? Well, I say forum, Steam. Steam's a forum, right? Nah, I don't use... Some Some of those setups aren't really... I've tried a few, but... Well, I've got one one wing. Oh, God, no. You need... No, 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 no. Because you're struggling a bit through uh, Ascaria, which I saw. Um, I'm running different wings than that. Personally, you need a little bit more than that. I mean, it sort of goes through. Sort of. You, you got to remember as well, when you get, in light fuel, yeah, it's fine, but when you put a whole load of fuel in, then you're going to be screwed on the first stint through that okay. sector, but, um, what, what's your, uh, what's the weather like for the race? Um, uh, I'm going to assume it's dry, because it's Monza, you know, so it should be dry. Nah, he, he two pounds on eight, mate. Uh, that's it all down. fine or whatever, uh. Wait, how do I? Uh, uh, yeah, I need. I've got. I've got both a wet and a dry setup. So round here. Ah! So pens really. If you go for wet, if heavy it's rain at the start of the race, and then light rain, and then that's it dry. at the end. Yeah. Oh, this is a tough one. Uh, we'll go for dry. If it was a full wet race, I would have given you the wet one. But um, I mean, are you are I, you ready, Mister Jimmer? Oh yeah, fuck it, right. Let's <laughs> get right. I'll fight this game. Rip Jimmy. <laughs> I actually do feel so good luck with Jimmy in this race because you're gonna need it. I'll be good, maybe. Oh, wait. Um, uh, right. Wings. Yes. Um, because it's raining, I'll probably go for either three two wings or four three wings. So I would have a play around. I'll go three two, come on, badass. Yeah, why not? Be a badass, mate. You know. Um, differential on throttle 100%. And off throttle 90. Okie dokie. Um, suspension, uh, the, both cambers all the way to the right, and then both toes all the way to the left. That's an advanced setup. I oh, know. <laughs> um, normal suspension in order. Five one five one seven five. Nothing like what I had. But okay, I'll take that. <laughs> um, pressure, whatever you have, because of your pedals, obviously different from mine. Mm -hmm. uh, I have my brake bias on fifty six, but again, play around with that in the hood. Uh, I tires, I think, are the same as Spa, so I think it was like twenty three and twenty one point one. 
Okay, that okay. Um, then weight distribution. Uh, I'll probably say eight, because uh, I think seven and eight's pretty good in the Hass, because I did do some testing. So I'll probably go for seven or eight. And that's the setup for Monza. If you don't feel comfortable in the wet, then just bump a click of wing on. Okay, doggy. If you want. Th thank you, Ryan. It's all right. Well, I wish you the best of luck in your future bottling attempts. Mate, <laughs> mate, don't. <laughs> don't say things like that. <laughs> all right, dude. Thanks for that. I'll catch you later on. Say, say, say goodbye, chat. Goodbye, Bye. chat. Bye, 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 bye. All right, okay. Bye, Mum. <laughs> okay, let's give that a go, I suppose. What should we do? We'll do we'll do fuel save. No, we'll do time management first. I don't, I don't, blah, 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 blah. Whatever, we're doing this one. Let's see how this goes. Ah. Oh. That I better be good. We're beating Van Dorn, which is not surprising. That's a new if we have my name on it. What are you chatting about? Not good for tyres, that. Softly, softly. Look how much time we lost going soft. Alright, that's pretty cool. I'm not sure how I'd even go about checking that, to be honest, but that is pretty cool. Alright, let's gain a second back for a scar easy. Hey, Neil, good to see you, man. I'm glad you're enjoying the series. It's a lot of fun to do. Okay, so we've got half a second to find. That ain't gonna be too difficult, hopefully. We need to pick up the pace. We're not hitting our target. We'll need to rerun the program if we don't get the time delta back in the green. Why are you? Should get through on green tire wear, not purple though. Yep, that's the line. Good line, Jimmet. Oh, so close, really. We could have done that, I think. I'm not going to try it again, though. We'll take that as our first go.
fuel saving. We're going to save that for next time out. Actually, is next time out rain or not? I forget. P2, there's rain. Uh, there's not at the start, though, so maybe I'll go out at the start. No, I'm going to do the fuel saving now, I think. No, I'm not, because of words. I'm not sure if they decrease the time as you go along, but I like doing it on a green circuit is a bit more difficult, I think. As all the cars are now over the line, your top three again are Fettel, Hamilton, and Kimi Räikkönen. How far are we off, Kimi? We did 24-5, and we did a 25-4, so we're uh, nine tenths off him. That's okay. We didn't go super fast. Um, I'm playing the, the the clutch doesn't quite work the same way in this as it does as you as you think it would. So I I am using the clutch on the wheel, but it won't be the same as say what I had before uh, in the in the video. By the way, guys, if you are interested in seeing the new rim, exclamation mark new rim in chat, and you can have a look at the video I put up today. If you want, of course. Also, of course, bear in mind that our times as well, we are running old components, so that'll be a thing as well. Shut up. So, guys, if you've just joined us, hello, my name's Jimmy. I wear tight gloves and love it. This is our F1 100% distance career mode, full distance races, chat to your size, all major decisions, no assist, no flashbacks, and no restart. See if we can save some fuel. Yeah, not the race have been raining so far, but hey ho. And quite know where the grip is at the front at the moment. I'm not quite that confident with the car. Fucking bug! Go away! <laughs> that was a bit cheeky. <laughs> Just didn't even attempt to make that. <laughs> Turning far too early. You're an acceptable lap.
Hmm. Now I'm not going to make it to the line in time. Like, oh, it's so difficult getting this right. Come on! Okay, there you go. Put it in the last lap. Nice. The break. Oh shit! They got rid of the bridge. I never knew that. Oh, I obviously wasn't paying much attention. Um, what is what is P three gonna be like? Because I might save the qualifying run and race run for P three. P3 is going to be dry, so I'm going to do that in P3. Okay, one of the programs we should probably do before qualifying. Shut up, Jeff! See that little smart army cunt. As best we can. We don't want to find us. An interesting practice session there, then. Let's remind ourselves of the top three. Who are Bottas, Raikkonen, and Lewis Hamilton. Practice times are on the board then, but no points are on just yet. We'll be back with more F1 action soon. Time trial setup again. Nope. I'm using setup from Ryan. Oh, really? I never knew that. Well, yeah, I'll do pit entry. I'll have to do that next time. Shit. So I, I'm not too uh, worried about our race pace, etc. Because we are going to be putting in the uh, the race engines, I'm now calling it. When we get to the session, get to the actual, actual session. Bam! Wait, no, wrong one. No, 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 no. There you go. Ha <laughs> ha! Best streamer. I know you guys like that Reese intro, but we can't uh, have it every time. That guy oh, first, says fuck. John Clellan. Glenn, thank you very much for the £10, dude. Saying, enjoying your streams, mate. Great skill at sim racing. Awesome how you complete these races. Thank you very much, dude. Appreciate the £10 there, mate. The very generous of you. Glad you're enjoying the streams as well. It's uh, I, I always wonder if streams get stale because obviously I, I wonder if I'm boring or not, which I am. But thank you, Glenn. Which reminds me to go and turn down the uh, uh, Segoy Crashu. Because that's too loud. That's too loud, man. I could test it and scare the shit out of all of you, but I ain't gonna do that. Righty! Let's try qualifying pace. I'm, 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 I'm curious as to where we're gonna be. Go to F1 2017. Just run laps. All we can really do is run laps.
Fucking curbs. Shouldn't be touching them really, but. Wang on this. Oh! Thank you, four planes. You've tested this setup in the wet on rain tyres and P2. Yeah, maybe I should have done that. Thanks to 179, dude. But hey ho, we didn't do that, so we're gonna suck. I don't get how to lose so much time in acceleration there. Let's lose. Lose speed at every corner. I don't have a diff in effect of that much, it's not really loose on throttle, just loose in general. I think a lot of this might be the fact that we're on our old engine. Our engine's like 70% wear, so we're losing a lot of speed there, I think. Can't adjust gearing. I mean, I can... It's, uh, I mean, I, maybe I might, um, I might put the the better engine in. So far, our fastest lap is a one twenty four point two. Oh, 
How much time I got left? We'll do that. And we'll see if that helps at all. We'll do the race run though, because I'm not gonna do the qualifying again until if we have time, unless we have time at the end. Ah, nice dude. Enjoy your vacation and your whiskey. One oh six percent. Some people say oh, he shit. often races like he's going backwards, but now he's putting it into practice. Thank you so much, GP4 fan, for 165 dicks. Saying some dicks keep coming. Fingers crossed. Hopefully, a great race where you kick Hulk's ass and KM Hags balls. <laughs> Thanks, man. I'll do my best. Thank you very much for the uh, large amount of dicks, dude. Hopefully, we can do better this time around. Let's watch that relative. Did I just say I'm not going to do a qualifying run and then did a qualifying run? We're losing less time. Too early. We're down on our target times. Let's try to find a bit more. Hey guys, I'm not asking for setup help at the moment. But I appreciate it, but I'm not asking right now. I've driven a lot of these races so far, and now this car handles, I know what works best for it. Let's get out on track while it's clear. I already have fake Jeff come in, this is fake Jeff setup. Can I put a wang on this? Oh! Thank you, an error for the 179. I won't be on well, the stream on live. We'll see it later when it's uploaded anyway. Here's my support. Thank you very much, dude. Shame you can't catch it live with us, but it will be about around later for you guys to watch. That's all right, guys. I don't mind the old tip every now and then, but the problem is when everyone's shouting suggestions, like someone's telling me I've got too much downforce, someone's telling me I've got too little downforce, someone's telling me my diff is fine, someone's telling me that it isn't. You know, like it, it just turns into noise. It, there's none of it is helpful.
Now I wouldn't say soak off the back seat was quite an annoying experience as a, as a viewer. My opinion anyway. See that? We've got some speed here. Too fast into chicane there, but we're all right. We've got a mur behind us. I'm not very good into the second chicane. Or through the first uh, Lesmo, actually. No, oh, this Mert's gonna fucking ruin my lap. No, nope, I'm not gonna block him. Fan fucking tastic. Fan fucking tastic. Good job, Merc. I'll just start my practice session again, yeah? Fucking cunt. Am I even have time to go out and do this fucking thing now? I think I am. No, I haven't got enough time to do it. About qualifying pace. Well, well, I've got enough time to do that now. GG. I'm not sure I'm going to retire it or not, but for this I'd be using this just so I've got some hat switches. I can actually do things. That... Just on the wheel now, so if, uh... I hate you, Jeff. Understood. Copy that. I'm going to be changing the engine before qualifying. When you say I'm not trying to backseat and then tell me to do something, that's backseating. Why does that menu keep coming up? Well, I think we're fucked. I can't do it. Well, that was a fucking waste of, P of Q3, wasn't it? Well, that fucking Mercedes, man. Quick look at the classification at the end of the session, then. Here right, I'm going to go and I'm going to put in some... As nice bits as possible. Does that make sense? 
putting the, the best bits we have available to us at the moment. We're actually starting to run out of components. I might take a grip penalty at one of my slower races and go from there. Luckily, it's wet. It's going to be wet for the first half of the race, so that should really benefit me. We'll see. It was Hamilton. Hi, it's Emma. Your qualifying goals came up in the board meeting this morning. Here's what to expect. What do you want? P12 and beat the Hulk. P12 might be a little bit enthusiastic, but we'll see. But not fitted already. Fucking flat like they just they just love my fucking face. I just like is that a face? Can I be in your face? Mm, gonna actually cheat and put him for that. I always do that. I always back out the laptop. My guy's like, oh, okay, and goes back into it again. Right, qualifying one. No idea how this is going to be. Uh, not a hundred percent happy with this as the car is at the moment, but that's part of it. We're trying to do the uh, slightly higher difficulty. If it goes wrong, then it goes wrong. But I actually enjoyed the difficulty last time around because I didn't just smash K Mag. I had to really fight him, which is what I think it should be like. Personally, I shouldn't be just beating him every race. Um, but. Oh my god, sorry. Qualifying is about to start here at the Autodromo di Monza for the Italian Grand Prix. The Autodromo di Monza Reno. Any minute now. Looking at this field today, Ants, do you think we're going to see anyone take a chance? Maybe run the harder of the available compounds and save some of the grippy tires for the race tomorrow? Well, I'd be surprised in all honesty. It's only the front runners that really have the pace to get away with that. And even then, at the end of the day, it's a big risk. Track position is the most important thing, and it's rarely worth sacrificing for a slightly more optimal strategy in the race, so I doubt we're going to see anyone trying it. I have been wrong before, though. We certainly do see some risky decisions every now and then, and it's a gamble that's sometimes worth taking. But if it were me in the car, I would want to be on the fastest tyre for my qualifying. It's never going to be you in the car, Ant. I'm just saying. Let's get out of there now. Put in a wanker lap. for like ninth gear there. Nope, not that. Well, that's some shit. That was shit. I don't know if I'm carrying any speed through there right now. <laughs> don't even far too early for that and surprise the game and let me have that. P3 on the grid. 
Nice parabolica there. Like how I'm now doing the qualifying pace that I wanted from fucking practice. Go, go show the difference a car makes, doesn't it? So where are we then after that? Still quite a way of Ocon. Ahead of, ahead of Palmer though, which is nice. You sort of expect the Force Indians to be good here though. So far, oh, this lap is a one minute, 23.1. Vicky hasn't gone out yet. But yeah, he's going around now. What's he going to do? Not as quick as me. You were in timeout because I asked you not to back seat and then you back seated. I don't do the thing and you won't get the thing. He's up in his first sector, I think. I have my nails painted because I like having them painted. That's literally it. There's no statement. Fuck, he went faster. Like three tenths faster. Do I go out again? I think I'll go out again. Uh, I'm also going to go to my setup first because I know that we can lose a bit of time with the fuel. Oh, I guess not. It's already, it's already taken out all the fuel we have. I'll take out a bit more, I guess, and do do it like that and see the one map. That'll give me like a tiny bit of time, maybe a tenth. Shut up, Jeff!
We lost a tenth there. But we got a lot closer to K-Mag. We took two tenths, only a tenth there. Yeah, tenth and a bit. That's better. I lost it. I lost a bit of that. Well, most of that in Ascari, frankly. So. Yeah, then stop talking about it. Came of crying out loud. <laughs> Come on. Don't worry about it. So far, our fastest lap is a yeah, I lost 22. it in Ascari. That's it's my own fault. I just went a bit too deep, and then I set myself out by for the second set to boot. You should be go. That should be, that's us in Q2 though, which is good. Uh, and importantly, we are ahead of the Renaults, which is nice. Oh, Hulk, you little cunt! It did that right on the last second! Okay, well, maybe not ahead of the Renaults. I want to say that my first... My worst... Uh, my worst result has been like a p11 maybe and he's no, no no nothing yet nothing yet i've I got to email them in about two weeks time did they nerf kimmy yeah i think they, they should have nerfed kimmy shouldn't they blue nails is because i like having blue nails that is literally it don't look into it at all there's no statement there there's no no deep meaning, I just like having blue nails. Not even blue nails, I like having mock colour nails sometimes, but that sends off an even different single. Which is uh, unfortunate because it ain't true. Oh, I, pl I plan on playing high one, don't worry. <laughs> Bit rough, very rough. lap so far. Trying too hard at the moment. A bit slow for Ascari. I need to be a little bit slow on the initial entrance. I don't think I, I don't think I can do a 22-7. I don't think I can do a 22-7. Does a fucking 22-7? Please kill me! Ah! <laughs> oh yeah. I don't know where that time was. I want to say a lot of it was at the Parabolica. By the way, guys, if you are enjoying the stream, hit the old like button. Last time we got to a thousand likes on our, our spa stream. I know that Monza may be not quite as entertaining as spa, but you can still help old Jimmer. Help old Jimmer. You're doing a great job. We're much higher up the field than we expected to be. Fucking Jeff of the low key insult. Cheers, mate.
Monsters are boundless though. How am I up? That was awful. Okay, I'm gonna keep going. Why am I locking? I was so... So easy on the brakes then. I locked. Are you fucking Hamilton's then? I can't even start on you that really because I'm going to lose some of it down the straight now. Yeah. I think that's it for us. I think I might have read that. Do I have time to go out for another quick flyer? I do, nice. I just prefer YouTube, my audience is here. Like, come to YouTube and stream to an audience of like 500 to 2,000 people, or stream on Twitch and stream to an audience of 100 people. Also, they're like, you don't get locked into stuff when you become a YouTube partner as you do on Twitch. Well, that's fucked. So I'll go to the end anyway. Tow me, friend. K Mag is worst fucking teammate. Did we get through the fucking Q3? How the hell? Q3, boys! Balls well and truly sucked. By the way, guys, we do have a uh, new emote in chat, I forgot to say. The Jim Creep emote. And hello. If you fancy becoming a sponsor, then you can do. Can I put a wang on this? Oh! Hey, you four planes for pounds, so maybe take the last corner more tight. You seem to lose lots of time there. No, I don't. Don't take the corner tight. Just because you donate doesn't mean you can backseat. Thank you for your money, though. Right. We've got a free set of tires here, so we can sort of go ham, which is nice. That's going to rain in the race, so I haven't really worried about wrecking those tires beforehand. Tag going for first, Shit. says John Clellan. Thank you, I club seals for the two pound. Kemma okay, seems to be taking the motion well. I know, right? Thank you very much. Oh, fucking curbs. Let's call it on the back then.
Oopsie. Hard to see a turn in there. That's my excuse. Oh shit, we're on the grass on turning. No, I fucked up the lap! Fuck me! That was a good lap! Fucking hell. Oh, so annoying. Just got a wheel on the grass when I was breaking. Must have fallen asleep at the <sighs> wheel! Why doesn't he move? Peanut, thank you for the appropriate donation. For the back seat, but just drive faster. Thanks, man. I'll try. Okay, the circuit is clear at the moment. We're good to go. <sighs> Guys, I can't even, I can't even fucking exit the game without you backseating me, for fuck's sake. What's wrong with you people? Oh, you could have gone in the pits. I fucking know I could have done! This is quicker! Oh you know, shit, lords! <laughs> Level 22, 7. Can't seem to just break past there. Short session. Oh well. So qualifying is complete, and we're all set for an exciting race tomorrow. Your top three are Hamilton, Bottas, and Sebastian. I think we should be happy to be in Q3, though. I could have swore I had more time than that. I don't know why they let me go out and then not do it. Right, and guys, as usual, we are going to pop ourselves into slow mode before we start the race. Just because chat gets a bit rowdy. Bless them. And we've got to think of our mods here because they do an awesome job. I only pay them in mediocre sexual favours. But I'm happy. I think I'm happy enough. I'm happy enough with P10. Oh, God, the noise. Um, thing is though, we are, yeah, we are going to be, uh, starting in the rain here, so that's going to be interesting, given this setup is not a rain setup at all. Um, we'll see. Hi, it's Emma here. Just wanted to let you know what the team are hoping for in the race. Okay, that seems easy enough. You never got paid in that. Well, you weren't awake. 
It's already raining because fuck the fuck this game. That's why. So then, guys, if you've just joined us, hello. I love you all, most of you anyway, and welcome to the stream. We're going to have this rule screen up so we don't get FOM'd to shit, as much as I love being FOM'd. Uh, this is my first race of a new wheel using the paddle clutch, so hopefully that works. I haven't actually tested that yet, we'll see on the line, won't we? Um, we're going to be starting on the wet here, I think it's going to be full wet. Yeah, it's raining hard, you can't see it right now, but take my word for it, it is raining pretty damn hard. So I think we're going to be starting on full wet tyres, moving... Pop, possibly moving to Inters, possibly. And then going to the, uh, the dry tyre after that, but I'm unsure. I guess I'm going to just go for as long as possible and just do what the what the AI do. Unfortunately, like, I don't know, maybe they'll fit this in the pats or not, but AI are weird and, like, changing weather. They can either be really fast or really stupid, and a lot of the time they're really fast, so it's quite frustrating. But we're going to be nice and easy. Italians love their cars. And Do they, Crofty? And of course, they love it here at Monza. Home race for Ferrari, of course, who've had 18 wins here since 1950. But you know, there's not been so much luck for the locals in the cockpit recently. The last Italian driver to win this race was back in 1966. So what now? Really? I think it's time to make some more history here today. With top speeds in excess of 220 miles per hour. No, the Haas. <laughs> hope to touch Monza's crown as the fastest circuit in Formula One. Hard braking zones going into three chicanes. Cars into the getty, damn right. Of the 11 corners on this 3.6 mile circuit. And just in case the slipstream wasn't enough, well, two DRS zones will help encourage some close action. Encourage. It's not Shut up, you. plain sailing for our drivers today. Although with the sky falling as it is, perhaps sailing isn't... Ha! 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 Fucking Crofty. Anthony Davidson, read from your script, please. It is a touch damp, isn't it? As a driver, when it was raining, you have to be careful of the rain. Tire temperature and visibility. Judging distance to the cars around you is really tricky when you try to... Hello! Oh! Off! It's Tarquini! Thanks, Ted, for the two. Well, how about giving a house meet a good old rub? Boy. Let's take a look at how the cars line up. Lewis Hamilton lines up on pole Get ready for the A-Hass. Bottas will line up alongside. Looking down is that my Haas? Fettel, Raikkonen, Max Verstappen, and Ricardo, Ocon, Perez, Hulkenberg, and a Haas. A uh, Haas. Magnussen, Carlos Sainz, and Kvyat, Palmer, Stroll, Pascal Wehrlein, and Fernando Alonso, Ericsson, and Stoffel van Dorn completes the grid. And now it's time to head down to the track. Okay, a track to the downs. This is our engine supplier's home Grand Prix. Let's give them a race worth watching. Why are we on Inters? It is pissing it down. What happens if I go to the wet tire? Oh no, it's like no, that's gonna okay, well. Oh my. Oh my god. So T1 at Monza. Hope you guys are ready. If you're enjoying the stream, by the way, there's a lot of you here right now. It'll be great if we can get this stream over to a thousand likes again. Oh my first, fucking god, Johnson. I'm turning that down. Kibik, thank you for the 10 PLN. Saying shake that hass. I will mate. Um, yeah, we do this, well, this is, uh, we do it, we're doing it Monday and Thursday right now, because next, or, or tomorrow, which is usually our F1 day, we're going to be doing a, um, uh, a word? I'm doing, doing F1 instead. Uh, F1? Words! A set of Corsa, fucking hell. A set of Corsa, public server, we used to do that back in the Dizay, so it'd be good to sort of go back to it and give it another go, I think. Um... Yeah, think about maybe sharing the stream around. I don't really know what to say. I mean, I, I, my, my mods say that I should be more of a shill. They don't. They say I should, I should tell people to tickle my bell button a bit more. But I don't really know what else to do. If you're enjoying the content, like it. If you dislike it, dislike it. But the only way this channel grows is through people engaging with it and sharing it around, etc. So there you go. That's my bit done as I uh, 
burn some more time while I just turn down all these fucking alerts because they scared the shit out. They're really loud. I need to get rid of a lot of them, I think. Okay, that should do. So I hope you guys are ready for 58 laps of Monza, I want to say. So let's see if our clutch works. I'm going to restart that, guys, because I need to have a clutch that works. <laughs> Where do I go? Oh my god, I'm so blind. The rules, it's the control, it's the control thing. It's a bit different, guys, when it's controllers. I still haven't got a clutch. I wonder why it's not doing it. I think I know why. Because it doesn't quite feel... I need to basically edit some dead zones, but... Um... I'm just not, I just haven't got a clutch right now. Why is that? I do have a gay down assignment, it just doesn't show it. I don't know what's going on here, guys. This is slightly concerning. Just telling me I haven't got a clutch right now. I know I have. It's there. I mean, I could just be a shitter and just... I don't know what's going on here. I'm going to double check that my clutch is... Well, my clutch is being detected, so it's definitely working. Let me have a look at this again. It's just a game that's not allowing me to use it for some reason. Thank you, Toby, for two pounds, saying, sort your pounds, or sort your god, go Jimmy, go Jimmy, go, thanks, man. Appreciate that. I'm going to restart the game quick. Oh, bright boy. Sorry about this delay, guys. I don't know what the fuck is going on. All worked before the update. I know you guys don't like these, I don't like these delays as much as you do, especially when we're just about to start. It's like a fucking big old blue ball experience, but 
Uh, let's restart the game. Hopefully that doesn't kill us, our progress. Thing is, like, if the clutch doesn't work, I just can't get away. I can't get, a, I can't get around not having the clutch. Unless I go and put auto clutch on. Which I'd rather not do, but if that happens, that happens. We will see. Is chat still here? Or has everyone just gone quiet? Am I still here? Oh, my, my chat just died for a second there. No! No! You little fucking game, you fucking bastard ass motherfucker! Huh? Huh? Kick me while I'm down, why don't you? Let me skip! I don't give a shit what the Italians like, Crofty, you cunt! Uh, I've got to go watch this bit again now. With top speeds in excess of 220 Shut up, Crofty, hour, you daft. ...can hope to touch Monza's crown as the fastest circuit in Formula One. Hard braking zones going into three chicanes... Why can't I skip this? I can never skip this. ...on this 3.6-mile circuit. And just in case the slipstream wasn't enough, well, two DRS zones will help encourage some close action. It's not going to be plain sailing for our drivers today. Shut up! You made that joke already, Crofty. It was shit. Too far from the truth. And Anthony Davidson could be a wet one today. Great to have you with us. What are your thoughts? It is a touch damp, isn't it? Well, as a driver, there are three big things to worry about when racing in these kind of conditions. Standing water, tire temperature and visibility. And judging distance to the cars... It is definitely really skippable, but I can't skip it. I'm never able to skip it. Spray. That these wet weather Pirelli tires kick up. With that, then let's run through the grid order. Oh. Lewis Hamilton lines up on pole position, and it's Valtteri Bottas that completes the front row. Looking down the rest of the grid, we have Vettel, a has mark too. Max Verstappen and Ricardo, Ocon, Perez, Hulkenberg, and a Haas, Massa, Magnussen, Carlos Sainz, and Kvyat, Palmer, Stroll, Pascal Verlaine. And Fernando Alonso, Ericsson, and Stoffel van Dorn completes the grid. And with preparations almost complete, let's head down to the track. Yeah, clutch won't work now. It's a long run to turn one. Do we have a clutch? No, we don't. But like, does that... What is going on here? Where is the auto clutch though? Show me auto clutch. Don't start spamming the chat, guys.
this manual. I'm pretty sure I was already on that, wasn't I? Gear down that is mapped. How do you think I've been doing this? That's just what it comes up with. I'm using my pedal there. Look. I think I know why this is happening. Really sorry about this, guys, by the way. That's the shame is up shit. I think this is a bug in the game, guys. It's just not detecting the clutch, uh, clutch at all now. Code Masters release update and break game. It's not a wheel thing, trust me. I might try setting it to a button though on my keyboard and see if that does it. Maybe that will, who knows, fucking hell. Okay, so it works on my. It works on my. It works on the space bar, but not on the wheel. Okay, well, I'll have to look into why Anyway, <laughs> let's go with the. Oh my god, I'm gonna have to have. I don't want the space bar here. Can I use this? Can I use my handbrake? It's not plugged in. shitty on the pitch, you're right. Well guys, it's the thing is it's not detecting the my 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 pedal clutch either. Or well, it's not letting me use it. Maybe it is too many controllers or something like that, who knows. Well, at least we're off now, guys. I'm really sorry about that. The race is about to begin now, hopefully.
So we're starting P10 on the grid. Into Q3 again for another time this year. Starting behind our rival Hulkenberg, so probably going to attempt to get him going down the T1 just so I can get him behind me. I don't think it to auto clutch didn't seem to work for whatever reason, so. But I think it's definitely a thing with the game as opposed to something with the wheel, because I've used the wheel, it's I can see it working on a... Uh, in the game controller as well, so I'm in there. Anyway. Yeah, I know space of pit stops, it's gonna suck a little bit, but I did take out that annoying noise though. Get rid of the clutch. Fuck you, Jeff. He's gonna go. Scary, 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 scary. That was good. da 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 Not a bad start, up into P8. K-Mag follows through as well, which is nice. Because we're behind faster cars now, so I don't really expect we'll do much in terms of catching the guys in front, but let's try and keep on the black stuff for now. First lap round here in the wet so far, so sort of finding where the grip is and where it isn't. right on me already. No idea where to break here at full speed and I'll probably go for the 150. Almost. We're decent for the first sector, but I really suffer through the middle. And that I'm sort of allude to having a little bit too little downfall, especially in these conditions, but hey ho. We are the deal train. We will deal with it. Especially through a scar, I got them slow through there. In real life, I take a lot wider line here, but uh, it's in real life, and I ain't an F1 driver.
Right, a bit of a gap to K-Mag now, that's good. I'm going to break it a little bit earlier. Heavy rain will be staying with us for a while now, at least a 20 minute window of heavy rain. So why aren't we on the wet tyres? I don't understand that logic from Cody. So we've had heavy rain start, I'm heavy rain for like first 40 minutes, we're going to stay on the Inters. This wheel's a lot comfier to use in the uh, Formula room, I must say. Let's try and maybe try and do something with Danny Rick here. The thing is, again, through the first and third sector we gain, but then through the middle sector, through the Lesmos, which I always snigger when I say, um, I just fall back. Ah, that's the worst place is to fucking hit the gravel there, you just lose so much time. If you have the money, then sure, we'll go ahead and buy a setup like this, but you can... This doesn't necessarily give you extra performance, it gives you sort of extra immersion, I guess, but... You're in the top ten now. Keep it up. And I'm really annoyed that mistake came out of second Lesmo, that really cost me a lot of time. That was very tidy for the first chicane. Weather, well, I know the weather's going to be like this for a long time yet, so I'm not going to bother asking for a report just yet. Well, understeer there. So wet on the exit. Rival status. The difference is seconds. Nice. Fresh inters. We think they've got two stops remaining. The time last lap was a one minute thirty seven point five. Oh my god. The worst fucking entry to Parabolic ever. Do we actually sort of have the pace over K-Mag right now? It's not a massive difference, but enough to not worry about it. Oh! See if nobody cares for the, uh, the pound there. I care nobody. Oh, looks like Verstappen and Perez having a bit of a fight. Should be good, that should back him into me, hopefully a little bit, although saying that Perez is definitely going to get past here because Merck engine versus Renault engine. Did I put, did I put the, uh, the round number right <laughs> for this, or did I put the wrong round number? It's also good Perez being in front of them there because he slows them up for the middle sector. The Red Bulls are fast uh, in the in the dry because of the downforce. And now that it's raining, some of that downforce is sort of negated. But they're just slow on the straights. Caro, thank you very much for the 25 pound dude. Fuck me in hell, that scared the absolute shit out of me. Thank you very much, man. I don't know why that's so small. It says, sir. <laughs> the small boy donation there. Thank you very much, dude. <sighs> Fucking hell. Thank you, Caro. I really appreciate that, mate.
Thought I'd turn that down more. That's at 40%. So that fastest first sector again. Thanks, Caro. Really appreciate that, mate. I'll go towards buying umbrellas for me and the entire house team. Fuck. Developing the car, and you better umbrellas. Just lucky it came on a fucking straight. Oh shit. Sorry about that guys. I had the uh, choice there to go straight on or cut. I chose cut. Uh, then you didn't donate 200. If it didn't come up, either that I wasn't cleared. I'm gonna use a bit of rich here, try and get a bit closer. Uh, my wheel isn't available for PS4 though, no, but you can hit exclamation mark new rim in chat and have a look at the uh, what it looks like. The pretty thing. put a wang on this oh thank you very much magic for the five pounds saying it's been a long time oh gear thank you magic hope you're well dude that's been a long time magic then check out your new emote in chat i know you're a sponsor uh, the jim creep emote which i'm gonna be I'm, i might go as jim creep for halloween Again with another 25. Jesus, man, thank you so much. He says, Look at this. <laughs> thank you very much, man. Fucking hell. You're gonna kill me in this race, dude. Thank you, though, man. Sorry that I can't be more sort of interactive with you. And uh, show my appreciation more. I'm trying to, but I'm also trying to concentrate. <laughs> it's not going very well, but thank you, man. Another step closer to owning a rotary machine. Carol doesn't like Monza. Yeah, it's trying to make me crash. I can't quite, I can't quite break K-Mag, he's still with me. Here we go on Rick though, ah, oh, just too deep. Oh, oh fuck, another one, Christoph, thank you for the two euro mate, good to see you Christoph. He says, Katsu, whoa, what the fuck does that mean? 
Thank you, dude. Oh shit, we got the run on Danny Rick here. He didn't want to take a line. To the outside. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Rex out of fucking Rex! You just got a hast. Run away. Oh, come on. Through. <laughs> to the outside. He just sort of gave up, didn't he? Saw that I was in the superior machine, I think, and just got out of the way. This rain is really helping us with the Red Bulls. I wonder if I can catch Matt's next. I actually really prefer using the stream. It's a bit smaller than the Formula Room as well. It's 270. I think the Formula Room is 290. Oh, oh fucking hell! Caro, fucking hell, dude. Thank you so much for the 50 pounds. Fuck me. More fun equals better alert, right? Fonk. I don't know about that, Caro. Fucking hell, dude. 100 pounds so far. Thank you so much, man. <laughs> I'm surprised I haven't died yet. But thank you, dude. Still not dead. No, dead. Dead, 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 dead. Not dead. Oh, I don't want to say it, man. Oh, thank you. <laughs> A little bit unfounded. I've got to try my best not to bottle it now. I do love a good bowl. Oh shit. Work please, work please, work please. Pressing like just for Caro. There you go. Yeah, that's something. <laughs> Thank you, man. Sorry if I sound like a bit insincere, I, I hope I don't. But guys, if you are enjoying the, the stream and the occasional me getting fucking shitted up by Caro, then hit the old like button. It'll be super cool if we can get to a thousand likes again. Of course, we've got the uh, elements against us today. Uh, well, I'll say that, they're against us, but they're actually helping us with his Red Bulls. We've sort of got past Danny Rick. A little bit of a gap to him now. And now we've got uh, Max Verstappen in front, who we are catching ever so slightly. I say, if anything, the more, the more people send in, the more I fucking bottle. As demonstrated there. I'm breaking too late now. I'm breaking, I'm breaking all my fucking drive, breaking zone. Just lost a ton of time. God damn it. a bit that'll bring us back into contention oh, 
so difficult to get the power through there. This is where the rebels are quicker, just through the Lesmos and through Ascari. We're quick on the easy bits. It's a bit too early there. I'm in real trouble slowing down for that. Trying to use the ending map like I would Kurs, so I use a little bit coming out of the corner to get out to acceleration. And then just let the uh, combustion engine do the rest at the top end. Danny Rick turned it up or something. Oh my god! Fucking hell, Caro. A hundred pounds, Jesus fucking Christ, saying don't ask for more chat, I won't do it. Fucking hell, man. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. Fucking hell, dude. Oof. I really appreciate that, dude. I'm sorry that, like, I'm <laughs> I'm trying not to pause the game. It's failing a bit because I'm sort of starting to flail around a bit now. But well, thank you, dude. Oh shit! Here comes Danny Rick. Please no, Danny Rick. Please no, Badgerino. Oh shit. Okay. Thank you, Andy, for two pounds, saying I'm not as rich as Caro, but here's towards the RX-7. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Caro, again, so much. And thank you, Andy. It's ridiculous generosity. I don't really know what to say apart from thank you. And know that, like, it's going towards what I say it's going towards, because I like to be transparent with that sort of thing. trying to center myself a little bit <laughs> trying I'm failing right now Slowest through a scary. Oh man. Mild track extension. Yeah, I, I remember everything like that. Like I'm constantly humbled by people. I, I don't know. All I, all I know, it, it goes towards pretty much supporting this as a job as well. So I'm always very appreciative, regardless of any amount. So, <laughs> but I want to make it clear that it's never an obligation to do that. You, this show is free. <laughs> it always will be free. Because I never want to be put anything behind a paywall, you know. Doesn't mean it's not appreciated, though. I hope Die Hard's okay. I'm pretty sure, like he, I 
I, I, I don't know if I remember this right. I feel like he's in the military and might have been deployed or something. Like, actually, one of my friends got deployed recently. I'm sort of worried for him a little bit, but luckily he's a badass fighter pilot, so he should be all right. New to behind the paywall. Damn right. It looks like the Red Bulls have turned it up a little bit. So now it's time to struggle on pace. Either that or the AI are enjoying the tyre a bit more. Weather report. We predict this heavy rain to ease up in around 15 minutes time. Okay. My exit coming out of there is what's keeping me ahead of Danny at the moment. Okay, gap ahead is 4.6 seconds. I think it's the rain is starting to go off a little bit and the uh, the other cars are starting to come back because of it. My theory. Rain is the great equaliser in F1. When it starts to stop raining, uh, the downforce cars start to make headway. Well, I'm, I don't plan to... Um, words. I don't plan to come in until it stops raining. I'm going to stay on the inters until then. So the gap to start to wander a bit in the braking. I don't know if you saw that. The rear started to move around a little bit, but it was controllable. Full race update. P7 now. P7. Verstappen is ahead of you. Our gap to the car in front is 5.3 seconds. They're on old inters. Ricardo behind. Less than a second separate you. They're on old inters. Your pit window opens in nine laps time. 37 laps to go. There you guys like your old race report. Usually Mons is one of the quicker races, but rain sort of makes it a little bit longer. The broadband train, it's just me and, uh, and Danny Rick right now. Came back from off the back of it. See that um, Verstappen's caught. I don't even, you can't really see it because I've got the webcam down there, but I can see that Verstappen's caught Perez again. I don't think I'm actually getting a bit faster. Not the rain. Yeah, you see that Verstappen's past Perez. I think what I was saying is right now it's the light rain's coming, the Red Bulls are starting to get faster again. So Perez has got back by, by and I've got fucking Ricardo right on me. You can see as well, but you can't see, but half, uh, so Kevin is actually dropping off a bit. He's like two seconds behind now. The gap to the car ahead is 4.4 seconds. I guess I'll just try and keep old Danny Rick here as long as possible. running on the grass there. Luckily I get a wave of breaking on the grass somehow. Ah, sorry about that Kibik. It'll be live later on mate so you can watch it then. What 
All right, guys, if you are enjoying the stream, don't forget to uh, like and subscribe, do all the good stuff. Maybe tickle my little bell button as well if you want to be notified of streams when they actually come up, as opposed to YouTube trying to notify you. Um, we are fairly close to 41,000 subscribers. It would be wicked cool being in this stream. If we don't, then no worries. You've got to have goals, etc. And you, as usual for these streams, our goal is to try and hit the magic 1k likes. I know, like, you, you must think, oh, fucking hell, this guy's telling me to like his stream, I'm not going to like it, but it's just serving as a reminder. It's never obligatory to actually interact in my streams in, at all. You can just sit there and lurk if you want. But, um, doing this as a full time job, people liking the stream, sharing it out, etc., it does help me, so. Yeah. If you're enjoying, then go ahead. We're catching Paris. Sorry about that guys, that was a bit of a blatant cut, but I was far too late on the brakes there. I had no choice but to slide it in. And that Force India isn't as good in the wet, or in the uh, drying conditions as it is in the wet. The thing is, Force India is just really fast on a straight line. I always say with like, in these sort of conditions, it's easy to have a, a car that's faster in a straight line, because that speed is always going to be there on the straight. Whereas if you have a car that's fast in the corners, as the tyres start to go, it's going to get a little bit wonky, you know? If that makes sense. Probably doesn't. Makes sense to me. <laughs> this wheel is so much comfier than the Formula Rim. But my wrists, I don't feel anything right now on my arms and my wrists, it just feels great. It feels great. We're reeling in Paris, fuck me, you must really be struggling. Weather report. This downpour will last for another 10 minutes, then we expect conditions will transition to light rain. Mm. What do you reckon, chat? Do you think at this rate it'll be better to come in and get some fresh enters when the window opens, or do you think it'd be better to weigh out? I think it's going to be better to probably get some new winters because I think we're going to be on this tyre for a little while yet I don't know I just don't fucking know what he's talking about get a beer with me I like to get a beer with all my chat be a lot of fun come up to a bar and be like beers please of anyone but Oscar. <laughs> Tire status. Just be careful. I feel okay on them, honestly. I mean, the weather report says it's getting dry right at the end of the race, right at the end, so I don't know. Expect this outcome. <laughs> I would like to go to Le Mans. I keep saying I'm going to rearrange and go again, but I never get around to doing it. I'm just lazy.
Oh shit. Yeah, I think that's a good idea, Joe. I don't have to be pitting at the moment either. We've got a little while for the uh, window opens. Oh shit! Thanks, Christoph, for the five euros. He says, "Have a beer for me." Thank you very much, man. I'll have a, a beer on you next time I'm out. Appreciate that, dude. I've been drinking less beer recently. I know I bought a couple of crates recently, but in an effort to just not be as round. It's going okay. I think what I'll do is I'll wait until we get into the light rain and then I'll ask him what's going on then. The presses tiles must be shot if I'm still catching him. Car's really responding to soft at the moment. Happy to say that my exits are a little bit better than Danny Ricks. He's faster than the Entrick of the downforce, but he doesn't quite have the speed in a straight line. Why you take it to the moment we go? Uh, it's it's not quite as simple as that. More like the transport getting there, etc. And I know I would really like to go. Because the one's fucking great. And I'd always I, I wanted to drive my MX-5 down to France, but then again, I'm sort of paranoid that I'll kill it if I did that. But hell, by then we might have a fucking RX, uh, RX-7 to take down to France, who knows? Uh, Captain Perez is staying about the same now. I think you should maybe turn up the other engine mode or something. To the car in front is 1.8 seconds. The Swiber Convoy. There's a, there's, there's a thing at the moment that I want to do. I, uh, I didn't get to do it, of course, when I went, I went with a friend. But um, going into the uh, the the Ho campsite, um, there was like a line of cars, and there was a guy with a checkered flag who was just stopping people and then waving the flag, and the person would do a massive burnout and go from there. And there was all sorts of cars doing it. There was fucking shit boxes and not so shit boxes. Well, I'm gonna up to Mr. Chicane there. Okay, you've been pushing your luck on the track limits really? That's the first time I've done it. Fucking hell. Well, GG that result, I guess. Okay, some information on Raikkonen. They've got a serious car. Oh shit. Kimmy dead. Like they're retiring. Yellow flag. I definitely. Oh shit! I definitely didn't save three seconds on a chicane. Saved about one. I've lost it already. Everyone's dying. No idea why scanners have got VR support on what the dev. Ask them.
I'd rather have the three second penalty given to me in the stop. I wish that was an option. Weather report. Rain will ease up shortly. Rain to become lighter within two minutes. Mm, I've got to stay out. Oh no, not Palmer. Oh, the big boys are falling. Just that it's still raining. So far it's just ripped that I would lose out to, so I'm okay with that. difficulty chosen. Uh, we started on 100% and we've worked our way up to 106 as the season's gone through. I just try and keep it so I finish where I think about I should finish in the race of the challenge, you know. Right now I'm in P6, which is why I, oh shit, Perez in. They're all coming in. I've got no choice but to come in, I think. And Danny reckons, shit. Weather report. We'll be seeing at least 20 minutes of light rain. Okay. Box this lap. Pitting this lap then. Come into the pits at the end of this lap. Oh yeah, shit, clutch.
Danny wreck through. Damn it. Grip on these. Right, so here's what I'm hoping. Fucking Perez the fast lap. I'm hoping that Perez will be caught by um, by Ricardo, and that'll fight, and that'll get me back into the fight. I've got a three-second penalty, whatever happens. So that's going to be annoying, but. trying to stay in touch with Danny Rick in front definitely faster than I am but I'm faster in the straights I seem to be imagining these tyres better than he does or he is at the moment on this early set Both catching Paris as well. Light rain will stay with us for at least twenty minutes, maybe more. Light rain is here to stay. We've got Ricardo, you know. leaves me behind. Oopsie. Good. This is good. Fight guys, please.
Oh shit, Perez wide. And he wrecked the fucking swipe there. Hamilton up ahead as well, who's slow. Lucky, very lucky. And we're barreling in on Hamilton. He's got that problem, it seems. is not blessed today boys I wish I could see what that rebel does. is so slow. Mm. He's good out of the parabolica. I can't get close enough to do anything in the T1. This is our chance. Yoink!
and then we've got a gap in by three seconds so and this race is going to be so hard to call because it's going to start drying out has the rain stopped weather report we don't currently have the data for that request. fuck you Weather report. Sorry, we can't provide you with that information right now. Still raining, but if you come in again, it will be for super softs. Happens. Hamilton still has so much speed in the middle for me to catch him. ETA on this rain clearing up is about 10 minutes, so just keep your concentration out there. It's going to be right at the end of the race, that is. I think we are going to have to pit in. We'll be foolish not to. I was saying that, we could maybe stay out and just block an Inters. I don't know. I don't think... I'm not going to change just yet, I'm just trying to figure out where I am. We haven't got any Ultras, I don't think. I think Supers are the, uh, the softest tyre available. I'd go for ultras otherwise. idea this way race would stay wet I'll take the used SS then Alonso there, I think, or Van Dorn, one of the Mac one of the Maccas. Not scary. Yeah, 
there's quite a debate in the paddock about whether he hey, Richard. to be in Formula One. Pretty short debate to my mind. Thanks so much for becoming a sponsor, man. I appreciate that. Enjoy your emotes. Including the new Jim Creeper emote. Yeah, Hamilton's speeding up again now. Oh, you're fucking shitting me. The AI is so bad. Look how much time I just lost then. And now we're going to go past him now. Yeah, fine. Cool. Good game. What happens when you get lapped? Dive to the inside. <laughs> Weather report. The radar is showing a clear patch on its way. There's about 10 more minutes of this rain. The thing is, I'm not really racing Ricardo, I'm racing Perez behind, I've got that 3 second penalty. And if it dries up, Ricardo will be a lot faster than me anyway, so... Might be worth it, I don't know, Joe. The thing is, if I have anyone behind me, they're, they're going to just take me to a position. It's not like defending to the end, where I can just keep the place. If anyone's within three seconds, they'll automatically get promoted, regardless of road position, so... I'm sort of forced, really, to pit. Remember guys, if you're enjoying the stream, hit the shill button, aka the like button. Same thing about subscribing too, and make sure to tick on my bell, because that way you get notified of when streams happen, and when videos happen, and of course you want that. P4 is not going to happen, the Hamilton's speeding up again now. And Merck is a bit faster than the poor Hass boy. Bottas is up in first place. Right. It'd be great if we can get to the old thousand light mark, guys. I know it's a lot, but that's sort of our goal for these streams. And if you are enjoying it, it's literally just a second for you to click the old thumbs up button. I don't think people will happen. I got a penalty for cutting the first UK when I went wide. I didn't really gain any time, but game yeah, fucked me, which is, I guess, is, flat, is fair, but I shouldn't have missed a chicane, but I just outbreak myself.
entire situation is an interesting one, but I think the right call is to stick with what we've got right now. Eight ten doesn't fire off one K at all, so thank you guys. Let's see how much Alonso's gonna fucking wreck me, shall we? I am far through the Lesmo, so maybe I can just get him through the uh the straight. I'm gonna get him through a scar, he's gonna slow down right from the middle, mark my words. Oh my god! Fucking AI, Green man! Flag. Really fucking collected me. Oh shit! Perez has passed Ricardo. I think he might have damaged Ricardo. Either that or Ricardo's come in. before the end. Weather report. We don't have the data for that, I'm afraid. I feel like a couple of that still slicks. Tracks dry out really quickly in this game. We're almost on six now. Probably next lap, even. We'll see. There's like no spray. Slippy though. Weather report. This rain should be ending shortly. Hamilton has just put up the fastest lap of the race so far. Tire status. Six point four seconds. 
Jesus. If I can keep Perez that far back, P5 might just happen, guys. Hamilton didn't pit, no. Be the slap, guys. Oh, am I going to make the call? Am I going to make the call or not? I say this. We'll see what the guys in front do. They come in, we'll come in. Tire status. Looks like it's probably about time we change tires. It's a bit of a crossover period for sure, but the longer we stay out, the worse it's gonna get. Boxer slap. Right coming at the end of this lap. Oh shit. They are not coming in. That's Perez. Hey Mac, please.
definitely the right choice. No, he was already far back. Paris doesn't come in. There you go. Stappen stood out. How far up is he? Only six seconds. If he doesn't, I don't know. If he doesn't pit, I won't catch him. But if he does, I might. Slipping through there. They're in the pits now, I'm not going to catch him. Tried and failed. Thing is, I got a beaten by three seconds anyway, so. Shit, Hockenberg Vals just went away. I mean, 
me. He's a Red Bull. He just trounces me now. We're dry. Like I said, even if I got past him, I don't think I'd be able to keep him three seconds behind. That corner still feels like it's wet. He's not going to catch me, Perez. That's uh, that's fine. No point going, Rich. I'm not going to catch Verstappen, and I'm not really fighting Perez. It's just till the end now. I'm not going to do the fastest lap now because the other cars have, have sped up. We we pitted, we definitely pitched at the right time. I don't think we could have gained any more places, but we basically just solidified our fifth position. And the thing that I was most scared about was having Perez right on me at the end because I got that three second penalty, which means I get three seconds added on to my race time. Oh my god, I'm just turning in so early now because the car is actually working. But, um,. Short story, if if he were three seconds or closer, he'd just be given the position automatically. So this way we should be okay. I'm not really driving particularly good, well at the moment. Yeah, I lost two seconds there. We'll go rich on the last lap. Not dropping that fast, Carl. Relax, dude. We might as well burn it up anyway. This is your final lap, final lap of the race. At the moment, the car behind us is lapping faster than us by around one second per lap. No, I'm not going to go under an AI. I think this is a good mix for me right now. I do have to fight for these positions. It isn't. I don't lock into them. I mean, considering that, again, we had no, pray, no pace in the practice sessions, we couldn't even do the qualifying goal, even to get the stand of one. I think to come home, starting 10 position on the grid, even with all our clutch troubles, and then finishing fifth in the race is a pretty damn good race for us again. We just seem to be having great races at the moment. Another fifth place. The wet really helped us, yeah. Yeah, scored! Yeah, scored win!
And I have to wonder, Anthony Davidson, just what set them apart from the competition here? I feel like consistency was probably the key today. There's being quick, and then there's being quick lap after lap after lap. If you can do that, you can capitalise on other people's errors without making many of your own. Well done. That's an approach that can push you a long way up the field. So as I say that, we can see the drivers coming out now to collect their trophies. It's yet more silverware to take back to oh, their yeah. Bradley after another excellent Grand Prix. Was Bottas still on the uh, the Inters? I think he was. I won't be driver of the day. I only gained five positions. It'll be like it won't be Perez. It'll be Ocon. And after this round of the World Championship, here's how it's going to be. The table. Well, the lead at the top has come down after a poor result. Well, we'll find out Peter. actually. And now I'd like to ask you, Anthony Davidson, who was your Might be me. of the day? Well, he had a great drive today. Somewhat unexpected, maybe, no. but I'm no. happy for Kevin Magnussen. No! <laughs> Clean, <laughs> no. control. It was everything you could ask for. And now, let's take uh... a look at the constructors' standards. Mercedes have extended their lead at the top uh... of the standings. <laughs> Meanwhile, good work from Force India this weekend, who pushed themselves further up the order. After all this drama, you'd be mad... Peace that shit. Race. We hope to see you then. Take care. Well, here are the driver's standings. We, uh, again, increase our gap to Felipe. Max is spilling away from us. We're sort of best of the rest right now, which is more than we could ask for. And in the Constructors, uh, Force India overtake Williams. But look, we are pulling away from Force India. We have uh, nearly 30 points on them now. So we're doing such a fucking good job this season. I'm really happy of another... Another fifth place. Surely, guys, that is worth a like and maybe a subscription. Hint, hint. Maybe a little bell rub. Please. That just been record. I'm sorry. Oh, I get... Oh, I'm one off 500. You probably have a faster lap than me. Oh, we did what? Okay. One more to beat him. Holy shit, look at Sauber and McLaren. I'm loving me. Williams coming in as well. Ferrari, not so much. Now I'm doing another race. Cause I need to go practice uh, some VA supercars. What does that even mean? Right then, guys. We do have one more race today. Straw poll, please, mods for the 2002 Ferrari or the 1995 V12 Ferrari. So straw poll, and then we'll get the the, uh, the old votes in chat, and then we'll do one more little race before we go tonight. I'm not going to stream my practice, no. I like to do it privately. Well, Sam ain't doing it. Well, it's like V12 is going to win it anyway. B12 is sort of winning, even though without a straw pole. Yeah, I'm gonna go the V12. We ain't got a straw pole coming, it seems. I think it's just Sam here, it looks like. Did I just cancel it? No, I didn't. Fuck, I thought I cancelled it then. Fuck democracy indeed. Sort of banned. Half banned. 
Welcome it's bright. to today's invitational event, where some of the world's finest drivers will be treating us to a special exhibition of some of the sport's most iconic cars. Fast boys. Overtake 12 opponents. Easy. I'm the best. Night. Can I put a wang on this? Oh, thank you, Heiko, for the pound. Saying, Jimmy, thanks, dude. You got your pound there. like 12 overtakes is going to be quite a bit for me. I'm not doing a good job so far. Carl really understeers. They, 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 they sort of miss the, uh, the sound a little bit here. They got the right idea, but I didn't quite get the, uh, the shriek of it. Oh shit. Thanks Zark, I like for two pounds. I hope you're having a nice night so far. I am, thanks man. Well, uh, that was a good race in ones. I was happy with that in the end. Made the right choice of tyres and that was very satisfying. Just a shame that we couldn't do more, much more with it. Go. Cool. Yeah, the AMS version of this car sounds and feels better, but I expect that, frankly. Overtaking someone called Gilles in a Ferrari. Bad boys. Have more. I'm surprised I did that because I was shit. Uh, that car wasn't 
The card doesn't feel too great, frankly. It's okay. Like, it's only okay. But guys, that's us done now. We had a good race at Monza, managing to make the best... Oh my god, Singapore, we're going to suck here. Uh, make the best of a car that was not great. Luckily, it rained. That really helped us. Sort of made the field a little bit closer. I'm just very luckily... With consistent driving and decent strategy choice, we ended up coming P5. Oh my god. Here's how you can tell these are my backup gloves, because I haven't used them yet. So the inside. I'm waiting for like... Can you see my fucking hands? Fucking dirty hand, boy. What you want? Well, there you go, guys. You got... You got a little bit of an insight into, uh, into next, uh... Next bit. But if you've enjoyed the stream at any point, guys, then please hit that like button. Maybe consider subscribing as well. Um, again, we're getting pretty close to 41,000 subscribers. It'd be cool if we can get there soon. Tomorrow will be a set of Corsa. A set of Corsa Fridays coming back. I'm going to set up some details for that later on. We're probably going to be using the Ferrari pack, so make sure you have that. Uh, and yeah, that's about it, really. So as always, guys, stay sexy. I'm going to leave you Best Box, Madden Box on the way out. I have no idea what my outro looks like right now. Let's find out. There, guys. <laughs>